struggle of this match. Yeah. So, is neutral be any good in this game? For Roy's. Game Oh, Not Game Watch. Game Watch, yeah. Game Watch is, is actually quite good. It does 5% per um, item. Item, yeah, because yeah. I feel like against Roy, it'd be quite a good tool to use, right, when I he's off stage. Potentially, but I think the up B will go through the projectiles, ah, is the only okay. thing. Right, okay, okay. That makes sense, then. It can be quite a good option just in your face or on shield. Yeah, yeah. Because it's actually pretty safe. You can get hit repeatedly by the projectiles from the neutral B, and it'll deal like 25% if you get caught in a really? position in them, oh, yeah. Because okay. you just get hit by them over and over again, and it just stacks up. Oh, this, this is a tragic game. Whoa, this is... Whoa, I know both of these guys. So we have two teammates fighting each other, Moak yeah. versus uh, Stranger. This will be, be to get top 24, won't it? I'd what imagine so, yeah. This looks like a very top 24 game to yeah. me. Let's go, Mike. Let's go, Sully. Woo! Um, they play Banjo and Lucina respectively, don't they? Uh, Banjo, and, Banjo and Lucina. That's yeah, it'll right. be Banjo versus Lucina, quite likely. Um, yeah. I sort of... Lucina's pretty easy to see what Lucina does. You know, it's just... She's solid. a pretty basic character. She's yeah, strong, yeah. you know what she does. That just works. Uh, Banjo's a bit more tricky. He is yeah, obviously got, a more of a setup, doesn't he? Yeah, well, he's, he's a very set play character. I presume his ledge trapping game is very good. Definitely. With the, with the grenade, right? The grenade especially, yeah. Because yeah. you can just keep it bouncing Three, there. Two, one, go! We'll see. So I'd imagine it'll, this match will be be Sully, or Strange, sorry. Strange trying to get in. And then... To an extent, because yeah, Moke is going to want to approach, but he's going to want to approach under protection of his Yeah, and under his terms, where he's, he's limited strength options. And, yeah. Exactly, yeah. The Star's doing a lot of work at the moment. I can definitely see this being tricky for Banjo, though. Just because Lucia's sword is an excellent tool, it's very fast, it's very safe, and you can just swat away a lot yeah. of projectiles. Yeah, yeah, like the grenades and the ice and the sword. Oh! Is that just for sure? Is that so? I think it was potentially him just trying to cover in case uh, Strange is going to jump out against him. That back end would kill the one. Banjo is quite heavy, actually. Okay. Oh, you think so? It's a bear. It does make sense, yeah. yeah. Oh, drag down to the nair. Yeah, he has some drag down set up, so very nice. You can do drag down into grab into down throw. Such a nice stuff. One of the nice things about the grenade Ooh. as well is if you are the one who held it last, yeah. if you throw it, you don't get hit by the hitbox. Oh, really? Yeah, it's only your opponent. That's really good. I've yeah, used a lot of these Wonder Wings this stock here yeah. just to recover. I, uh, the percentage, the percentage that I've done that, taking it through. It you makes enough sense. You might as well yeah. use them. Yeah, yeah, you're burning them at an early percent. That's going to need more worry but If you've got the resources still, you might as well try and use them. Nice. That means that Strange is doing a pretty fantastic job so far of just keeping Moak out. It's a pretty close game overall though. These two will play a lot, obviously being teammates, or I'd assume so anyway. Yeah. That being said, I think Sully is still at Lancaster and obviously Moak's graduated, so maybe not as much as I'm thinking. I think he's in Moak's in Manchester now, so it's not... Yeah, he's in Manchester. It's yeah. not super far away, but obviously they're not going to play as much as they would have Yeah, he's playing a lot. Um, it's going okay though. So we sort of just um, racking up the percent at the moment. This is what Lucina does well. If she yeah. gets a lead, it can be so hard to take that lead off yeah. of her. She can play as passively or aggressively as she wants to. Nice catch the up smash though. Just calling out the jump attempt. Obviously it's going to be quite a slow paced game. It's just the way Lucina plays, fairly slow paced. Yeah. And obviously Moke is going to be playing pretty slow with Banjo. It's sort of just boring that with the Gentiles at the moment. Sully's not doing a very good... Sorry, Strange is not doing a very good job of... Um, oh, I like the Wondering uses there. Yeah. He uses the down beat to give himself a best face on stage. Doesn't seem like we've seen those um, edge trapping gamers too good. Banjo can be kind of hard to life track because you have to respect Wonder Wing. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because it's invincible, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Uh, Using the throw armor to get through the explosion oh. from the grenade there. Yeah. Then doing a down the on shield to put him back on. 
I'm not saying even uh, this, uh, regarding in regard disregarding that one ring. This feels like trapping whilst okay. Yeah. It's not quite as good as some yeah. other characters like trapping. Oh, so wow. went very deep there. Yeah, not gonna yeah. get it though. Got caught by the grenades. Got caught by a grenade into Wonder Wing for his troubles. It seems like Mork's just struggling to get damage. He's only getting little odd hits. He's not really up. Yeah, nice. Yeah. He starts really off that. Uh, what's the name for it again? Dolphin Slash. Dolphin Slash. That's the one. I was thinking Soaring Slash, but no one's got this one. I can bring off that into the back air. Yeah. Solid. Confirms. Yeah. It seems like. Like I said, it seems like Mork's really struggling to um, rack up damage. He's getting no lot hits, but it doesn't seem like he's getting any of his setups. Yeah, it's 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 a hard matchup, I would say, honestly. Yeah, and still he's a very very good player. Yes, he is. He's good at melee as well. He's just good. He's yeah, good at honestly, time. just everything I've seen him play in, he's just good. At yeah, he comes he comes to tournaments, doesn't practice, and like he's second. <laughs> yeah, like, sure. there are just some people that do that. You yeah. know, who's got innate sense of the game and they're just good at it. Yeah. Sully's so definitely one of them. Stranger is definitely one of them. Stop calling it those now. It's because Sully's on the screen. Definitely. Sully just feels more natural to save than Stranger yeah, as well, you know? Yeah. Alright, so we've hit uh, turn save. This obviously makes sense. It gives uh, them a bit more room to move around with. Does Lucina die relatively early? Pardon? Does Lucina die relatively early because of just how her up B works? Does I happen? wouldn't say it to be honest, because her up B is pretty good overall. It's got um hard to challenge. It's got frame one invincibility in the air. Okay. So okay. if you're the sort of character that can maybe catch the end hitbox potentially, yeah. but very few characters can do that. It's very fast, it's a very generous hitbox and has all the armor on it. So with Lucina you need, you need to catch her really before she goes to your team. Like when she stops twice the last one. When you're more one. Okay. The best way to sort of intercept the team's recovery would be, which is quite far out, you have to go out and hit her. Yeah. Which either forces an early up B or like, an air dog or something, you know? Yeah, there's, there's, no, there's no real benefit to gain on the side on the up B. Yeah. Um, I believe side B doesn't give you any more height anymore, does it? It doesn't, no. no. It doesn't stall you in the air like it yeah. used to. I should make it. Oh, wow. You look surprised, so you don't punish that with the F smash. Out. Wonder Wing can be deceptive because it goes just a bit further than you think it will. Right, okay, you got caught on the platform. I'm not sure. I like that, using the slow projectile there. And just letting him and sort of giving it to as well. Yeah. Really smart play. And is that is that does that launch pad have a hitbox? It does, yeah. When it falls down, it's like an actual physical object. Like say. snakes, uh that's good though. Saves him just to end yeah. him right there with a the grenade. Yeah. Is it like Snake's Taunt or the box? Yes, it's like that. Or like Sonic Spring. Yeah. Again. Seems like Mulk's main game plan here is use the race to cover his torches while he's going in. Yeah. Uh, you see us breaking it out here. Just having a sword is just a massive boon in this game, as it is melee as well, to be yeah. honest. Oh, they got the one Wonder Wing left. He's probably going to burn out on this recovery. Oh no, he used the grenade. That was sensible coverage. Yeah. Just oh, caught by that character. Yeah, that was very smart. As soon as he got hit, then he was probably dead because he burned his double jump. He only had his, uh, his up B. Sensible option for both of them. Ah, he's worked the best for Sully. Yeah, he finally got the grab from the, uh, the Nair. Holding it's a very frame tight setup. I'm not even sure if it is true. It might just be one of those things that's true to the one that can deal with. Yeah, like in tournament situation. Yeah. yeah. So he's not breaking the job. He's just getting like, here, honestly. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. He got, yeah, like you so said, he got scared that he was going to carry on. Yeah, it just looks like he was a little extra bit further. Yeah. It doesn't... It sort of doesn't have, like, a full mega thing. Oh, he got the down air. That only hits... Uh, the, like, the... Not the tip, yeah. I don't know the exact hitbox. It's like... It was a tip. 